Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In this video today, we're taking a look at a video titled Most Popular German Song Each Month Since January 2010. So I've done quite a few reactions to the most popular German song of all time. And I've done quite a few reactions to oh, if you didn't know we're German. So let's check out this video. And if you guys haven't already, go subscribe to the original creator. Their link will be down in the description down below. But let's check out this video for today. Okay, this song gives early 2010 vibes. I remember this guy in this song. I like the style of this one. I remember this one from before. Wait, Madcon, I remember them from the Begging song. Like, they did the best version. Is that the same guys? I mean, that's crazy. I actually didn't know they were German. Okay, this is such a 2010 song. Another one. This style was so big back in the day. Mad Corn on there again, they were huge in Germany, it seems like. Okay, I remember Pietro Lombardi. Oh, this style was so good, this guy. See, that's like an Akon type song. Like one of those pit, like a Pitbull type song as well. Pit, Akon, Pitbull, Neo. That's kind of what this style reminds me of. I like it. I kind of miss these type of songs. He's singing with so much emotion in that part. Bro, yes, this guy has so many good songs. Don't think about me when you break my heart. Don't think about me. I'm Oh, some rock on the list. Let's go. Bro, again. Okay, that's definitely one of my favorites. I love these inspirational type songs, but I really miss the diversity of the music in the early 2010s. It makes me want to go back. Like, I don't really know many of these German songs except for times I've reacted to them, but like in the world, like music was just so much more diverse than the charts, it seems like back then. <laughs> I remember this. Crow again, he dominated 2012, it looks like. I remember this guy, he was good. Cascada, she had a few songs, I remember. Bro again. Willst 
Willst du mit mir Drogen nehmen? Dann wird Gib mir ein Echo, Echo. Okay, that song definitely sounds familiar. Like, I think there's an English remix or something to this song. Definitely sounds familiar. Okay, this definitely seemed like a great 90s song to me. And this song was everywhere, of course I know this one. A great song. Yeah, this guy is always good, Andreas. Crow, of course. Mark Forster, one of my favorites on the reaction video, same with Pro. I can't believe there's a German version of Band Aid. I actually was not expecting that. I mean, do they know it's Christmas time? Everyone knows that song. Not expecting a German version, that's pretty cool. Of course I know this song. Mark Forster again, one of my favourites from Germany. Okay, that seemed like a nice song. I'm liking the positive vibes of these songs. Great dance songs. Okay, now we start to see more trap coming in. So I've noticed that a lot, like in the 2016s to now, German, the German trap music, rap music scene has taken over the charts. It's crazy. In the early 2010s, it was a lot more diverse, and I do kind of miss that in music in general. But it's still pretty diverse, it seems like, so far. I remember this. Mal Forster, my boy, I love this guy's song. I remember this song. This song was big in England as well. James Blunt, yes, James Blunt. Okay, this song was one of the most popular songs I believe. This song is really good. One of my favorites. 
Ich ist nicht hier, euer wenig Bruder ne? Denn man spielt nicht mit dem Feuer ohne zu verbrennen Na Morak Now I'm, I'm shining from the rooftop baby Tell me Okay, I like that guy's voice. Nico Santos. I'm liking a, I'm liking a strong, powerful voice, yes. Und alle meine Freunde finden, dass ich leiser bin. I don't understand. They sound like she was singing for the heart in her song. See, you can notice this style of music is starting to take over in the late 2010s. See, though, yes. See, this music isn't really my style. There are some good songs, but it just isn't for me personally. Hey. Good to see Robin Schultz still in the charts in the 2020s. Oh, yes. Okay, Crow, I wasn't expecting this. Robin Schultz. I mean, you got this music in every language, this type of song. Okay, I know I said this in the last video, but I definitely prefer the early 2010s music to the late 2020s. The late 2010s, 2020s music so far. But I mean, there is a lot of good songs either way. I mean, throughout the whole list, there was a lot of good songs. And my favourites are definitely by Mark Forster. Sido, S-I-D-O. I don't know if I said his name right. And obviously Crow. There's a lot of good artists on this list though. Definitely some that I've heard before. There was quite a few I've heard before because I've read to German music quite a lot on this channel. But there was some that I didn't know. And it was also nice to hear some that I kind of forgot I've heard before on the list. So if you guys want more reaction videos like this, let me know in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day everyone.